sometimes you gotta let everything go so you can find your way. You really know. That's why now I can breathe. I can is me. I let go of all things problem solved is me. There were so many petty things that I let affect me. And you know what petty boo bitches niggas they test me. I'm so over everything now my life been stress free. I've been queening on the throne. Peasants cannot get to me. Bitches calling my phone. Dope Air Magazine exclusive. I'm out here with Mrs. J Songbird. Yay! Hey, so, so tell the people at home what's happening. What you got going on with projects you, you know? Well, my last project was Trials and Tribulations. And that was my first debut album. It meant a lot to me or whatever. And I pushed that three years ago. Um, it had a lot mm. of good songs on it as far as Occupy Your City, which was a, um, a big song, which was, um, had a lot to do with what's going on right, well, right now and back then. Hello. When we shut the ports down and everything. So, yep, that's what's up right now. And I have an upcoming project, my new single, Fuck them. Um, I have a nonprofit organization coming up with my father and my sister. It's called Pulling Families Together. So be looking forward to that. Okay, the new project I got on now is Fuck Em and Finally Free. Finally Free is a very sentimental song to me. It's about letting all the bullshit go, the fuckery, whatever you got going on that's holding you down, it's pulling you down, it's time to let it go. So I sat down, I heard a beat that my cousin made for me, G the Hustling Barber. Check him out on Instagram, hey! And um, I wrote to him and just poured my hot heart out. You gonna love it, I do. All right, so what made you, what made you uh, write that song? Like, what, what, what was you going through? Um, at that particular time when I wrote that song, I was dealing with like family issues as far as always being there for people that I didn't feel necessarily was there for me. And you know how certain things start putting a toll on you and it start weighing on my soul. So I, it was like so much and I was still trying to focus doing the things that I want to do. But love have a big hold on you. And my family, I love them. I got their back. So I just wrote and I wrote what I felt. All right, so um, what, what would be your next next um, upcoming project? I know you talked about um, you have the nonprofit. So, you know what I'm saying, you care to tell the people at home about the nonprofit organization, like what are you doing and things of that nature? The nonprofit organization comes together as far as um, pulling families together, which is pulling my last name, Johnetta Pullen. And so me, my father and my sister got together because I see a lot of homelessness going on in the community and I see a lot of people who are scared to go to shelters or for whatever reason. And so I was like, I want to be the go-to person that there to help them because I myself was homeless before too, my family. So we experienced and we know how tough it is. And so I want to be able to help and touch those people with as far as resources. I want to be an advocate and speak when you can't. I want to be able to get you um, health insurance. I want to be able to get that all that provided for you. I want to be able, if you feel discriminated against for whatever reason, I want to be able for you to come to me and me to give you the proper resources to handle every situation. So, and me and my father and my mother and my sister sat down and we put that together. So look forward and if you need any help, contact us. Pulling families together. Okay, so um, what other moves? I know you got the, the, the book out. Um, are you planning on writing another book or anything of that nature? I'm working on a new book right now. It's a fiction book. My last book was a poetry book, Trials and Tribulations, My Poetic Journey. Check that out. But my new book is a fiction book and it's um, a female um, form from East Oakland. And well, you gonna wait and see. It's a lot going on, but it's very interesting. It have a lot to do. A lot of people will be able to relate of what's going on right now in the community again. So check it out. But I'm not gonna give up the title just yet. Just look for me, Johnetta Pullen, Jay Songbird. All right. So, um, what else? What other kind of moves are you making? Are you thinking about making? Um, do you want to try to get into like doing uh, activists, being an activist in the community? Do you want to be uh, just a writer or an artist? Or what do you? What all the things that you want to entail? What do you want to do? trades. I got a lot going on. I graduated from college for fashion, merchandise and marketing design and so um, that's one of my um, passions and I can help people with that as far as like if you you do need help like kids going back to school and their parents can't afford certain things 
you can contact me and we'll discuss different things about getting you a proper makeover. Like, I'm also um, experienced in the cosmetology field, so I can do hair. I got my makeup certificate, so, you know, also that I can, I'm touching people with music because that's my passion. That's what I love overall. But I have a lot of things going on. And I also want to help a lot of young artists, too, because it's a lot of people now who want to do music, but they don't have the proper resources or know how to get to the next level. And so... Um, I don't have all the answers, but I want to be that stepping stone where you can come to me and I can reach out to certain people and get some advice for you and help you get to the next level instead of just, you know, wasting a lot of money, keep going to the studio, but not getting to the next level that can put you on a certain platform that can get you in the eyes of the right people, you know, or even how to build up your Instagram and Facebook, you know, so. All right, so any last words for the people or any shout outs or anything that you want to discuss before, you know, I'm saying the interview ends or concludes? Let me know. Uh -oh, Let yeah. the people know. Uh, uh, Jay Songbird, y'all, check me out. Um, Where can they find coming. you at? You can find me on Instagram, Jay Songbird One. You can find me on Facebook, Jay Songbird. Um, I'm having a new page coming up with interior design and also um, advertising my new book. And it's Johnetta Pullen. You can still go check out my old book in Barnes and Nobles. Jay Songbird. Johnetta Pullen, Trials and Tribulations, My Poetic Journey. Again, I have the new single coming up, Fuck Em, and Finally Free, so look out for it. I want to give a shout out to Dope Era Magazine, hey! Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so, that's what, um, pulling families together. Check out the foundation if you need help up, coming soon. We're going to be the go-to people. My father, Johnny Pullen, my sister, Adriana Pullen, all my loved ones. Yep, it's going down for feel. Jay Songbird, y'all, rocking with Dope Air Magazine. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Check it out. Shit. Check me out. You can't solve them. Money solve this. Man, if music hitting this, I got my hands in hella shit. Man, my mama hella sick. And diabetes, that's a bitch. And the needles make me sick while I sit and watch a stick. Honey, you know when you look me in my face and I say that I'm okay, okay. Honey, you know. Honey, you know. Every day, wash my face and say, fuck us What I really got to face, daily base, fuck a luck My money on Democrat, I'm tryna Republican up So I don't care about your baby daddy or who beat you up But I can give you some advice, like, get your money up Cause when you get up on your shit, yeah, they laugh you funny up And they be Instagram famous, then you laugh your money up I be sippin' on this Henny and ain't need me to be no bitch Nine eight hundred brick, still this what I claim I represent Free my brother, little Joe, PFN to you hoes You can catch me in the hood if you really bout that hatin' But I ain't into too much talkin', so it won't be no debate Honey, you know when you look me in my face And I say that I'm okay, okay Honey, you know Honey, you know Feels good to be free, cuz I looked out for me. GDB on them beats, he got that slap for the streets. And he loves me, he told me to stay to myself. Cuz my health is my welfare, I help anybody else. I made up my mind if I'm gonna really survive. Then some people got to go. My decision was final when I nearly lost my mind. Cuz these streets can be so cold. When you see me smiling, but inside I'm dying. Some people may never know. And I say that